Welcome to this video tutorial from CoreTechnologies.com. Today, we are going to show you how to run the free SpeedFan computer monitoring utility 24-7 as a Windows service with Always Up. Once we are done, SpeedFan will start automatically when your PC boots to monitor your PC in the background even before you log in. Let's get started. First, if you haven't already done so, download, install, and configure SpeedFan. Next, download and install Always Up from CoreTechnologies.com. Next, start Always Up and select Application, then Add to open the Add Application window. In the Application field, enter the full path to the SpeedFan executable, speedfan.exe. If you installed SpeedFan in the default location, this will be C colon slash program files slash speedfan slash speedfan.exe or on a 64-bit system C colon slash program files x86 in parentheses slash speedfan slash speedfan.exe In the arguments field enter slash nosmbscan this flag prevented SpeedFan from scanning the SM bus and hanging when it started on our PC, so we recommend it for you too. Feel free to add other SpeedFan supported command line parameters here as you see fit. In the name field, enter the name that you will call the application in Always Up. We have specified SpeedFan, but you can specify another name if you like. We are now done configuring Always Up so click the Save button to record the settings. In a couple of seconds, an application called SpeedFan will show up in the Always Up window. It is not yet running though. To start SpeedFan from Always Up, choose Application, then Start SpeedFan. The state should transition to running after a few seconds and SpeedFan will be working in the background. Note, on Windows 8, 7, Vista, and Server 2012 and 2008, SpeedFan's main window won't be visible. This is because SpeedFan is running in the isolated Session 0 and can no longer interact with your desktop. If you wish to see SpeedFan and interact with it normally, choose Tools, then switch to Session 0 to move to the isolated Session 0 desktop. Click the Return Now button when you are ready to return to your normal desktop. That's it. Next time your computer boots, SpeedFan will start up immediately without anyone needing to log on. Please restart your PC and test that SpeedFan starts as expected after Windows reboots. We encourage you to edit the SpeedFan entry in Always Up and check out the many other settings that may be appropriate for your environment. Boost priority, send email if SpeedFan crashes, and much more. Thank you for watching.